Hi everybody, this is a Cruyff turn tutorial, so a complete breakdown of how you're going to practice, perform and then execute your Cruyff turns in your matches and your training. So to practice this, what you first need to understand is a Cruyff turn is a change of direction. But the common mistake a lot of players make when performing a Cruyff turn is they keep their standing foot facing the direction they're moving. So if I'm moving that way, to perform my Cruyff turn, I don't want to do this because if my toes are pointing in that direction, I'm turning back here, this is a really uncomfortable movement and it sends me off balance. This foot needs to turn out from the ball. So as I approach, I turn this foot here and I get this foot advanced to the ball as well, which creates a nice channel for this ball to roll along. So as I pull this ball back across my heel, because this foot is advanced, it can comfortably move the ball across and then I've got my change of direction. So, we'll have a look one more time. As I do my croy, I'm travelling that way. I get my foot past the ball here, leaving this channel available. I turn my foot in, which makes this a much more comfortable technique. And then I go pull across the heel, and then I'm off to play in a different direction. So, to practice it, you can practice this over and over again. Really simple, just get the ball moving. Little croy, I'm turning my standing foot in. I can add another extra touch if I want to. Turn to play. Drop my level, nice bend, nice flex in the knee. Look how my foot's turned in to pull it back across my heel. To go here, back. Okay, loads of practices. You can add that touch in if you want to. The reason you'd add that touch in to make it an L shape is if you're about to be tackled, if there's a challenge coming, you can just pull the ball and then you get it into that position behind this foot so you can use the turn again. So at speed, I move forward, back to go across and away. Or if I just want to do it without that, I push the ball and get it rolling, turn in, pull the ball and off I go. Practice it over and over again.